In this video, I'm going to show you how to replace the downstream O2 sensors on this BMW 535i xDrive. This is going to be located in the exhaust down next to the transmission. Let's get into it. We're going to move this shield. Use an 8mm socket. Take these screws out. Should be one there, in the back, and one here. Here. Up front, we're gonna use a Phillips head screwdriver. You will loosen up these screws. You just twist them about 90 degrees. They're not going to come out, but you just need to twist them so this loosens up. So that separates the two shields. That's fine. Now just holding the shield, there's one more nut right here. Use a 10 millimeter socket. Take that off and grab the shield, pull it down, and just pull it out of the way. We're going to remove this shield. I'm using a 16 millimeter socket. Take these bolts out. And grab the shield, slide it down. Using a eight millimeter socket, we're gonna take this shield off this bolt out. Take that out. I'm going to use a 10 millimeter socket. Take this nut off. Helps to use a swivel socket. And take that shield down. We're gonna disconnect the connector. The one we're doing is this one right here. This one goes to the O2 sensor that's further out. The procedure for the other one is gonna be the same. You would just disconnect that connector. You can slide it out of the retainer. Just pull on the connector. Just pull them apart. And pull the retainers out. Slide the wire out of the way. Now I'm going to take an O2 sensor socket. This is a 7 8 or 22 millimeter with a slice in it. Go over the wire. Use my ratchet. Once you get that started, you should be able to loosen it by hand. Make sure you twist the wire while you're twisting the O2 sensor out. And pull the O2 sensor out. Now take the new O2 sensor, get that lined up. Get it started. And take the socket, snug that down. And we'll torque that to 35 foot pounds. And take that off. And take the wire and put that through the retainers and put the other wire in as well. This is going to go over here. back. 
line the connector up. It only connects one way. Lock it down. Go through to the hold down. If you're doing the other sensor, the procedure is going to be the same. I'm going to take this shield, line this up. Stud lined up and then up front, put the bolt in, get that started. Now snug that down. That's good. I take the nut, get that started. Tighten that down. That's good. Snug that down. Now install this shield. Up, get the bolts started. Now snug these down. Now I take this shield or panel, slide this in place, get the stud lined up. Now get the nut started here. Should hold in place. Up front, use the Phillips head screwdriver and just screw these in place. And secure those down. Now take the screws, get all the screws started. Should be one there. Those are all in. We'll tighten those down. Now we're going to tighten these down.
tighten those down. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.